Yes indeed, y'all. Yes indeed. Welcome to UDR Productions. Please like, subscribe, and share. It doesn't cost you nothing to subscribe. So we can keep bringing you guys all this good content from prayer to streets. UDR Productions. Let's go and let's get it. Folks, what's up once again? You're listening to Being Part of the Correct Part 2, your host MVP, most valuable poet. The proud thing of radical black Puerto Rican man and God from the Bronx, the life started, current resign, virtual CT. We're going to do a part two right now. And I want to give an introduction. Well, first of all, I want to acknowledge once again, first and foremost, to the Almighty God. All things are happening because of you. We give you all the honor and glory. Blessings. We want a peace and blessings. So I want to give a shout out and introduce two amazing men that's here right now and we're just going to just have a conversation we're going to just drop tools so jersey introduce yourself my brother well y'all already know we back at it again jersey in the building so it's good i just want to introduce all y'all <coughs> and everybody that's out here following to my brother-in-law gambino gambino give a shout out to the people who don't know you out here yeah but you know it's gambino representing for the girls them and the ladies them and the people them and uh, we here so I want to first start off, <laughs> listen, we're going we're gonna to have a blast, listen, we're going to have a good time, we're going to have a blast, and we're just going to just really have just a real conversation and, you know, we're just thinking about, like, what to talk about, and I just say, you know what, I'm going to throw a word out there, respect, True. and the reason why I say that word is important, well, that's one of the words that's important, the reason why is because there's been a lack of respect, True. you know what I'm saying, where I don't know you, you don't know me, but you True. have a wall up and you hate me, why, you don't know True. me, yeah. how can you hate someone True. you don't even know? True. How about dropping juice and let's collaborate? Let's get, break bread and fellowship. Why True. not get to know one another? Why not say, you know, what you know, what, what is your God-given ability to really help uplift and be in a position to uplift others and not crap on somebody where you're trying to boast yourself? There has to be a mutual respect where we may not always have to agree on everything. We can agree to disagree, but you don't have to undermine and disrespect. And I see that a lot. And True. to me, it's like that bothers me. It's like, you know what? True. We can agree to disagree, as I said, but you don't have to ostracize and put somebody down because your views differ from mine or vice versa. So what do you guys say to that? What is your perspective? And let's just kick it from there. Well, me, I'm point on that right away, right? Yeah. You see, respect goes a long way. It does. Goes a long way. You know why I say respect goes a long way? Talk to me. Because, listen to me, respect, you can, you can, be, you can be he and she and her. Or whatever. The respect alone from how you show that respect goes a long way. And I, I could say it from, from experience because my brother in law will tell you I work for myself. So when you show respect to people, it comes in abundance. You know what I mean? Right. So, so, so you, 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 you give the blessings to show love. I mean, that's respect. And it right? comes yeah. automatic. You it's know, automatic. And the thing about it is that. P respect is something people actually value and you know what when they see that you walk your talk and True. you're about that life of trying True. to be productive not destructive and you're being legit and True. you're being honest and being a thoroughbred True. people respect that True. they actually respect that True. so you don't need to cut corners you don't need to try to undermine you don't need to try to insult someone just to get respect if you got to tell someone y'all want respect you ain't gonna get respect First let your body of work do it talk respect together. has yeah. come naturally but right. you gotta sit there and i mean disrespect somebody or and i mean come at them negatively then like i mean that shows you the person you are right the kind of character that you got True. I mean, true. At the end of the day, you got no respect for yourself if you're gonna sit there and go out there and disrespect somebody else. Cause I mean, at the end of the day, like, like I said, I always try to find a positive in anything I do. Know what I mean, whenever shit gets rough, which, for which me, is right, which whenever, is right. When things get rough for me and you know it get hard for me, I'm not gonna sit there and just go out and attack the world. Like it's easy for me to go back to my old ways, trust and believe. But why? But where's it gonna put me? Putting you nowhere. He's gonna go put me back in jail, which oh, I don't want to go. Six feet under. Or six feet under, because that's the only, that's the last step for me, because I already been to jail. So, you know what I mean, I ain't got time for that. Like, it's just not worth it. Over <laughs> over little things, little right. thing. I mean, true. I mean, like I shoot pool. Somebody mad over a pool game because 
they missed a shot or they thought they was as good as me and they realized that he went against the GOAT and they got, they, they got their feelings hurt. That yeah. happens a lot here. Now, but you know, I see the, I see but, the, I see the good domino. Right. Who can play domino like me? Nobody. Nobody. But then they get their feelings. They, because they get their feelings of a domino game. But see, the thing is, what you do and what I do is that we respect the fact that you're challenging us because you want to get better. We love the game. Yeah. We love the game. We love the game. And, yes. And we respect the fact that we respect another challenger. Like, okay, you have that much courage to step to me. I'm not mad at it and I appreciate it. Right. But don't get mad when you, when everybody knows what's going to happen. True. You you looking for the unexpected, but True. we all know what's going to happen. True. But you got to remember something too, though. Every yes, one of us has a God-given ability or whatever it is. Yeah. You got to develop that craft. So let's God, say, God example, give you a, God, God give you a craft. Saying. He gave you a craft and you got to put in the work to yes. cultivate that talent, to cultivate that True. work. And when True. you make a mistake or True. you feel short, figure out how to and get better. Like, for example, like when I was growing up, I used to play ball. And I was like, man, I'm going to dominate. But I see someone that had a better game than me. I'm not going to get mad. I'm like, oh. You know, oh, he's better than me. Oh, he's yeah, better than yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. like, you know what? I'm gonna hit the lap. I'm gonna get up earlier. I'm gonna work on my shots. I'm gonna work on my drive. So you trying to develop and continue so you to work on your game because you work on your game, right? Because greatness has a way of separating from good, and True. and at that same process, True. you True. can be that great without disrespecting someone True. and say, you know what, man? We could, I could be great just like you, and vice versa. True. And when you do great things together, this is how Mount is moving. But that's all about True. knowledge and learning from someone. Like, I mean, we spoke about that last time. We, we did. We, we, that was me, you, and Hank up here. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That was talk. last Tuesday. And we, yeah, we were talking about that, <laughs> and we was just like, yo, I mean, you battle rapping this and the other. Right. Like, I mean, someone better than you, like, damn, let me go back and hit the pen and You got to hit the line. You got to go to the line. I got to get my shit real right. Because right. I know I ain't up to par. That's respect for someone else's craft or mm -hmm. skill or talent or however you want to diagnose it. That's respect for them. So, I mean, yeah, go ahead. And at the same time, you also mm -hmm. can take the opportunity like, yo, let me highlight you. Because like I said before, when I'm shooting pool, or even when I'm cooking, like cooking, right. that's that's my God-given talent. That's my gift. It's actually cooking. That's a wonderful gift to have to, like, I mean? to feed people. Not only is it a, like, it's a skill, you know what I mean, that it's you an art utilize. Form. It's an art form. No, God gave but, you a gift. Right, you it's mean? an art but form. that's my gift that I can share anywhere in the to world. Anybody, to anybody, anybody. Yes. And I love the fact that I have that gift to be able to, you know I mean, change someone's day mm -hmm. or perspective right. on an individual just based off what I've made. Right. True. Because I could sit there and make a Vietnamese meal and they sit there like, oh, Oh, shout out to the chef. They came out here and they see a, I mean, a six one. I mean, nah. Uh, and they like, hold on, he did that. And yeah, I'm just cool. like, yeah, better cool. than your grandma, huh? Right. Cool. But think of it like this. But think of it like this, though. You had a God-given ability to be a chef, to cook with love and cook with, with creativity because you enjoy the whole aspect of it. You know it. everything love, about it. I love being creative. You like talk. You talk about music. You love everything about music, as far as the beats, the lyrics, and just content, just trying to figure out, just yes. getting more creative. Yes. Me as a poet, it's about getting. Heavy and speaking from the heart, and just speaking about different topics. When you love everything, what you do, is, everything is from right, the heart. It, it's you're from the heart. When you love what you real. do, you're gonna love every aspect of that, and it should never be disrespected because someone else has something negative to say. Because at this point in my life, I'm not trying to hear negativity. If you're about that, you'll miss me with that. But, 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 yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah. Natalie, Natalie, straight up. Who cares about negativity? I don't. Because you see, we believe in God. Of course. Right That's or wrong? Where it started. That's where it all started. So, at. in life, you have two things in life. What's the two things? Good and bad. Right? The bad is the negative. The good is like that's God that's that's pushing right. pushing you out. Right. It's called I, discernment. I, I, we don't worry about that. Right. But, I mean, you can look at it from good and bad. I look at it from right and wrong. It's no the same thing, though. It's the same it thing. It is to a degree for me. I'm just saying for me. To a degree, everyone knows right from wrong. But it's that good and now, bad. I mean, you you see your niece. You see your niece, Naja. Yeah. Where your damn slippers at? Uh huh. Yeah. I'm gonna whoop your ass. You yeah. damn slippers. Yeah. Guess what? She find out where them slippers is yeah. real fast. True. True. She know right, but she's choosing to do wrong. Why? No one taught you that. No one trained you to do that. That makes so sense. at the end of the day, it's not really so much a good and bad because she may not understand good or bad, but she <laughs> knows that what she's doing ain't right. But Naja, <laughs> but I hear what you're saying. But life is about good and good and bad. It's like yes or no. That's how life is. Yeah. That's how I look at life. There's contrary to those opposite words like good and bad, good and evil, yes or no. There's contrary 
there's contrary to all those Thank aspects you. of that, right? Thank you. And, and get, Thank you. You know what I'm saying? There's contrary to those aspects of that. It's a matter of what I love to use is the word discernment. Yes. Know the difference between right and wrong. Good word. Know the good difference, word. Right. Know the difference between good, good and bad. Know the difference between good and evil. Just discern the difference. And yes. when you discern the difference, then you're able to decipher you see, you as see, far as you see the difference. Right. You yeah. see the difference. Like what you're saying about yes. your niece. You know, you know, you, well, you know the difference is that. Why are you getting sloppy? You know right and wrong. Don't do it. So there's a contrary to those words, and those words have impact, but it's how you use it and why you're using it for. It's the most honest. important thing is the, is the message behind it. I think sometimes True. also is True. Yeah. what is True. good as opposed to that person's, you know, perspective, <coughs> like what their vision is. Because what you may view as good, so in my view is bad. That's true. So you're I mean, right. You're, because you're right 100. And, and, and that's what you know. A lot of people miss you know, misconstrue and get confused with a lot of different things because everyone doesn't have an understanding of what's going on. Because what's good to you could be bad to me. That's vice versa. True. And vice versa. And vice versa. Because right. you can simply we can speak on this. But I'm not gonna go too far in depth with it. Right. But I mean, you can sit there and say right. white and black. He's right. Right. He's right. You can sit there and say good or good versus evil. You know, heaven and hell, right or wrong. Yeah, I said no. At the end of the day, who's to decide what that really is? Because everyone has their own perspective on what is one way and what is the other way. Because what you may see as mm -hmm. good, someone mm -hmm. else can see as an evil. Mm -hmm. True. Like, you know, so well, that's why I don't really like to get into that because... But here's but his where it gets more interesting, though. Because, let me respond to what you said, Jervis, about, you know, everybody's going to have their own perspective of what good is to them, what evil is to them. Where's the communication? Because if what you think is good for you might be even for me, but we would never know unless we have that sit down and say, you know what, B, let's break bread and let's talk about that because you know what? There's a reason why you might think something's good for you, but it's bad for me. The part of the process is this lack of communication. Yes. Part of the process is that's yeah. lacking is respect the where problem? if you have I'm a difference a of opinion. Right now, bro. Like, relax. Yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, hey. You do know they can hear you. Yo. Listen, you, you do realize they hear you. Sir, sir. Now, sir. Right. <laughs> listen, the one thing, listen, I'm going to tell you something. The one thing, let me tell you Sheena, something. Bro. Look, Sheena. listen. Bro, she's still calling me right now. Listen, listen. listen. Rock, do not, listen. Leave that shit do not, do not disturb. Put that do not disturb. Listen, listen one thing I'm going to tell y'all, you're never going to know what's going to happen when you hear some being politically correct. That's okay. what makes it good. That's <laughs> what makes it authentic. As you can see, they'll be going a little harder. Hey, don't, 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 don't. No, 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 no. no, no. Oh, but, oh, but, 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 let that motherfucker, yeah, let hey, my, my thank ring, you. and just, you know what? No, but, this no, is, no, but, but, listen. Listen. You, know, you know why? You know why? Because right yeah. now, right no, now, we, right no, now we're doing a show right now. No, so what, you guys saw, what you guys talked about earlier, not even five minutes ago. Right. It made so much sense. It does because you know what? Here's what's like everything. Everything is logical. It's yes, logical yes, yes. and it's and it's being intellectually yes. knowledgeable in terms of what we speak. Because I was saying earlier, what you might find good, I might find it bad, or vice versa. Exactly. But you exactly. would never know what it, the, the root, what how deeply something rooted is until you speak about that and say, look, let's just brainstorm and figure things out. That's how you learn from one another because you might be setting your ways, but when you have someone that can speak to you on a level that they're not judging you, but they drop and juice you, you're going to look at them and say, you know what, man? They're bringing a whole different idea. Not True. trying to change, but like me, let's alter my thought process. True. So it's not about changing the person who they are, but just looking at things differently because we look True. at it the same way, we ain't going to progress. No True. way, no how. But you know what the issue with that is? Right. The issue with that is the fact that right. people sometimes aren't willing to listen, and that's also an issue that's conflicting with a lot of individuals. Is that but, nobody but, wants to listen though. But Naji, the they, they have a they have a term. But yeah, but, but they have a, no, no, the term is seven brothers, seven different minds. Yeah. So but, so so we don't all have, three of us all three of us might hear what's going on, but the other four brothers not listening. Yeah, but the whole, You're right or wrong. But I understand that the whole thing about the whole what he just said though, which I agree with, is that right, he, no, he's right 100 no, no, He's right. I'm not taking that away. 100 percent He's right. Most people though won't take the opportunity to sit down and listen and, and listen to yes, someone else. Yes, which yes, goes back to yes. what we started this whole conversation about, which is a lack of respect. Right. If I True. respect you and you respect me, sit True. down and let's have this conversation. True. I'm not judging you. I'm not mad at you. I'm not coming at your head, I'm not coming right. at your neck. I got a gun to your head either and say you better listen to anything I say and you better right. do it when I no. Right. Nothing at all. But True. just hear me out. Take time. Just just listen to our you. listen to our yeah, voices. Listen. Hear? listen to our yeah, voices. Yeah. And, and when sometimes when you do that, you also gotta learn to speak in a calm manner because most people automatically that don't want to hear you automatically are guarded so if True. you're coming at them in an aggressive manner automatically their guard is going to ante up the, right the guard is up right away yeah 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 now they in defense mode 
Right. Why? All I'm trying to do is help educate you. So sometimes you gotta step back from you as an individual, you yourself, who's trying to convey this message to somebody else and let them know like, yo, bro, ain't no disrespect. I'm just trying to kick some knowledge to you. I'm just trying to, let you put, I'm trying to put you on to something different, that's all. Now, if you wanna listen or you don't, that's cool. But at the end of the day, it goes back to making the right or wrong decision. And that's how I feel because you're choosing to ignore something not True. me, True. because now you talking your blessing. Right. True. Because you want to ignore it because it goes back to like you said, not me. People not thinking logically, they think it emotionally. Right. But but my, my feeling, thing is my thing is common sense is not common to everybody. Yeah. Right. But also right. like you right, right or wrong. Right. Right. right or wrong. And we agreed on that that not right. me. This generation has tended to be overly sensitive. True. It's a, it's a hypersensitive error. Like, True. True. Overly sensitive. It's a hypersensitive error. Literally. Ever. You're right. Naji, you're right 100%. I mean, you go like this, I'm like, yo, bro, that shit's fire. Yo, what you trying to say? I'm sorry, I'm giving you a compliment. I like right. that shit. Like, right. you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't like you as a man. Like, that's you, bro. But right. yeah. you, you killing that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Know what I mean, that's you. Yes. Respect. Yes. But I think what it comes down to is two things. Number one, wow, time yes. go by. Time is right, so much time. But I'll say so this. So much time? Yeah. Woo. Got wind down. I say this, two things. Number one, yes. for every decision that you make, there's consequences. That's what they fail to realize. Yeah. There's consequences, good and bad. You do good, good things happen. You do bad, bad things happen. That's number one. That's true. And number two, like I said, DJ we're here to educate folks based on what we understand, what we know, and just our life experiences. So again, we're not telling folks this is what you're gonna do or yes, else. Sir. But what you decide to do in your life is your decision, but take ownership of what you say or what you did. Because yeah. if you don't even do that, you're never uh, gonna get respect. Plain that's and simple. True, that's true. That though, sometimes, true. I mean, sometimes true. step mm -hmm. back and think right, respect. before yes, sir. you Me react. Respect that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stop and that think makes so much before sense. Before you mm -hmm. react, whatever mm -hmm. it is you may be going through, whatever thing might just happen to you, stop and think before yeah. you react. Right. Because that split second can cost you your, your life. life. Yep. It's gonna happen to so mm -hmm. many true. people. Mm -hmm. Men mm -hmm. and women, it don't matter what don't matter race, what it is. Don't matter don't what it matter, is. It don't matter. Mm -hmm. It happens to so many people in that split second they yep. lose their life. Whether it's them physically losing their life or them physically losing their freedom. Mm -hmm. It happens. So sometimes you gotta sit there and open your mind up to a lot of different things. Right. You know what I mean? And sit back and just self-educate yourself or talk to somebody that you know. Just talk to somebody. I mean, I'm not saying pour your heart and soul out to every individual. No, we don't do that because, I mean, True. True. we all we all get sauced. And, True. I mean, sometimes we get a little too overly emotional. We all, we all have our then, own life. And then we vent and don't even want to listen to what the person's saying back. Yeah, that's yeah. true. That's true. So, yeah. I mean, True. sometimes you True. just, you know I mean, True. take every opportunity as a learning opportunity. Even if you know the answer, listen to someone else's response or their answer to the, you know what I mean? Because like, they're giving you perspective on something that's completely different. Right. So you never know what other something else you can learn from another person based yeah. on their response and answer right. to a question. So I mean, so yeah, again, man. I was no, gonna say, ahead. yeah, I was gonna say, man, Katan goes by so fast. I'm telling you, Katan, this year's been going by fast. But I just want to say this, 20, folks. 2020 is done. Yeah, just about. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's you done. you, you blink your eyes, man. It's gonna be it's gonna be December 31st, folks. With that being said, listen, mm -hmm. we love you guys. Mm -hmm. Once you guys want to tell you guys, subscribe to UDR Productions Go Love Team. You support your boy MVP, support Gambino, support Jer, support my boy Dog. Folks, we, we, just, we, we, we just giving it to y'all straight, man. And like I said, we're going to keep it 100 no matter what. And Where like that? I said, while they going through eight squad, whatever squad they got going on, that's between them. But on that note, on that note, MVP, you're going to stay focused. Uh, you have a man? You have a man? Yeah, he's, yeah. 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 Man. On that note, man. yeah. On man. Yep. Gambino. Yeah. We hear it. Gambino, I'm a son called On that note, Listen, on that note, folks, God bless you guys. Subscribe. We're going to get to next bless time. Love. Next time, out. Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings. Blessing right, love. No, Blessing uh, love. Definitely, definitely. Blessing love. Shout out to Top Flight. Let's go. Blessing love. I like this. I'm going to come here every week with you, bro. I like No, I like this. 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 We are, we talking about topics. We're talking about life. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah. I like this. Najee, I love this. That's what we do, man. That's what we I do. I love this. No, this is different. This is totally different from what I normally do. Me too. Usually, this is nice, you. bro. It, 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 gives, it gives you an opportunity to be exposed. Right? You're intelligent. He's intelligent, right. and we. I'm intelligent. We all have our intelligence. Yes, we right. all speaking different. We're, we're all things. speaking different yeah. ideas. Yeah. But yeah. bring it to the same, forefront. It's, it's the same idea. Same, same, same topic. Same topic, yeah. but everybody talking something different right. from, a, from their perspective. Yes. Right. And that's what. Yo, I'll come. I, yo, I'll come every week with but you. But this is what we're trying to bring to the light. I'm glad I came with you today, bro. I'm glad you came. I'm glad you came because you know what it is. This ain't about me. 
clean. This is about giving God all the glory. Number about one. everybody. About number everybody. Two, number, that's number one. Number two is about giving people a lending voice to speak. You know what it is? Giving them an opportunity to connect to anybody, anybody. that's on the stage. Anybody that's on this platform, we give you an opportunity. You good to off the mic now. The, the, um, it's turned off. Fine. You good off the mic. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. It's, my, it's my in law right here. It's no, my in law. No, but my bro, it's my bro right here. It's my bro right here. Bro right here. Bro, all this is, is it's, a good, it's a good look. Right. For me, it's a good look. It's a good look for you because it gives you a chance. It's a good look for all of us. Are. All right. of us. All right. Right. Yes, indeed, y'all. Yes, indeed. Welcome to UDR Productions. Please like, subscribe, and share. It doesn't cost you nothing to subscribe. So we can keep bringing you guys all this good content from prayer to streets. UDR Productions. Let's go and let's get it.